Hello, welcome to DIY It Is. Today we've got another video for you. And uh, we're going to make this 3D origami heart. I think it looks really, really cool. And it's a 9 by 9 centimeter square that we've used. And um, yeah, this from the back, this from the front. So it's slightly puffed up. Um, yeah, we've got the 3D name with it, to be honest. And I'm going to show you how we're going to make it. As you can see, I made a red one and a pink one. So, like I said, we need um, square paper, pink square paper, 9 by 9 I'm going to half it. Open it back up and twist it. So we've got one fold in the middle. And we've got it twisted. Now we're gonna fold here to the bottom like this about two millimeters. Then I'm gonna fold that side. Now I've got the opening here on the bottom. Then I'm going to take that corner and fold it like that. Press that down. And the other side the same. So in the middle there's a little gap. There's not really a, like a really pointy bit. That remains the opening there. And twist it like that. The opening we've got here. And I'm gonna open this or fold it like that. And the other side the same. This is what we have. We open it back up. And we're gonna take that corner. I'm gonna fold it towards the fold. So we've got the heart shape kind of starting now. That's uh, that side the same way. So we need to close the heart. I'm gonna fold that little bit that's there. Oh fold it over and open it back up and then you can see we have a gap in there and we place the fold a little triangle fold in there and there we go same on the other side so we're gonna fold that triangle bit this bit first open it back up and then we're gonna place and uh, then we're opening this triangle and we're folding our little bit in there and there we go Right, this is it at the moment. Right, the three D effect is uh, still not there, but that's still coming. Not to worry. I've got the. Um, this one is very pointy. This heart, and the other one is a little bit less. The more you fold the corners, the more round your heart will be. So you can just fold it a little bit, the pointy bits inwards, to create a more round end. Same on that side. And then we need to blow in the opening there, 
it's a little opening. Right, then we need to blow. And there we are. And it's now all folded and open and the 3D effect. This looks really cool. I hope you enjoyed our video. If you did, then please subscribe to our channel down below for free. And always be the first one to be informed about new videos. We have loads more videos for you. So I'd say have a look on our channel. And if you've got any questions or any comments, please write them down below. We're happy to answer and reply to them. Yeah, hopefully you enjoyed it. And we'll see you next time at DIY Days. Have a good day. Bye.